Hello! So, as you may be aware, the prologue quest for the upcoming Greymore chapter just dropped. The hype is indeed real. I'm very excited. Uh, so I thought I would play through it for you guys. Now, I'm going to be using my main. This is my Magicka Dragon Knight here. Okay, so in order to start the quest, I'm going to go into the Crown Store. And we're after this. Uh, prologue quest, The Coven Conspiracy. Yoran the Skald King requests that I meet with his agent to look into a plot that threatens not only Skyrim, but potentially all of Tamriel. Groovy. Uh, so let's purchase that. And let's have a look at our journal. What are we doing? Uh, Yoran the Skull King requested I meet with his agent to look into a plot, blah, 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 blah. Yep, we've heard that already. The messenger said that the Skull King's agent is waiting at the Fighter's Guild. I should head there and speak to her. Which Fighter's Guild? There are many. Presumably, I'm going to head to Davin's Watch. Uh, I'm playing as an Ebonheart Pact character. So I'm going to try Davin's Watch. If you're in a different alliance, I guess try Volkelgard or Daggerfall. Or maybe you can go to any of them. Who knows? Uh, and presumably, you don't actually need to go into the Crown Store first. You can probably just go straight to the Fighters Guild. But don't quote me on that. Alright, cool. So let's head to Davin's Watch. Groovy. Alright. Uh, Try not to land in the fountain. Yeah. Ah. Um. Find the Skull King's agent below. Below where exactly? Up here. Aha. That used to be inaccessible. So I'm assuming it's down here. <gasps> Lyris! I missed you! I mean, hello! Vestige! You're the help the Skull King promised? Mm-hmm. Suddenly I feel a lot better about our chances. Still, this threat is bigger than King Yorin imagined. Uh, what's the threat? The Ice Reach Coven. Witches operating in secret right under the Skull King's voluminous nose. And this isn't just the usual reach mischief. Of that, I'm sure. I need to investigate, but I can't do it by myself. All right. What do you need me to do? Help me locate the coven and determine their ultimate intentions. Between the two of us, we can cover more ground and figure out the full extent of this threat. As long as the magic Euron's wizards gave me works as promised, that is. Magic, eh? Um, all right. I'll help you investigate. Where do we start? Meet me in Deshaun. The Skald King's scout spotted members of the coven near the shrine to St. Realms. We'll start there. As for the magic, I'll tell you more about that when we're away from prying eyes. Cool, cool. Uh, how did you learn about the Ice Reach coven? King Yorin sent me to look into a sudden barrage of storms in the Sea of Ghosts. At least two ships sank beneath the freezing waves. The Ice Reach coven was responsible. I uncovered evidence suggesting they're planning an attack on the mainland. What kind of attack? I'm not exactly sure. That's why we need to investigate. But if they have the ability to summon destructive storms on command, think of the damage they can inflict on towns and cities. Look, are you ready to go or do you need time to prepare? Um, let's see. Before we go, tell me more about the magic. She just said she didn't want to explain the magic here. Let's ask her anyway. Keep your voice down. <laughs> Buildings have ears, especially guild halls. Sorry. I'll give you all the details when we get where we're going. I chartered a wagon to take us there. Is there anything else you need to know before we head out? Uh, how have you been? Well, we defeated Molag Ball and stopped the plane melt, but the Empire I knew was dead and gone. There wasn't anything else I could do for Varen or Cyrodiil. But Skyrim was still there. So, I went home. What have you been doing in Skyrim? Whatever I can. Traveling. Dealing with problems as I encounter them. <laughs> My axe has been busy, that's for sure. Mostly I've been helping Yorin the Skald King, looking into bad situations. Like this one, with the Ice Reach Coven. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, I see. Uh, all right, I'm ready to go to the meeting place. Let's boogie.
This is the place. Can't say I know what Reach Witches would be doing here. But the Scald King Scouts have never sent me on a wild guar chase before. Let's see if the trek out here was worth it. Uh, all right, so you're going to tell me about this magic then, or what? I was getting to that. All right. At Ice Reach, I picked up a couple of the medallions the witches were wearing for further study by the Scald King's wizards. The wizards determined that magic was infused into the jewelry, but not its purpose. Uh, how's that supposed to help us? The Scald King's wizards added their own spell to the medallions. We each get one. Here. They're supposed to lead us to magic similar to what's contained in the medallions. Ice reach magic. Wave it around and see what happens. Wave it around and see what happens. Sure, what could go wrong? Don't look at me. It's not like Nords are known for being great mages. <laughs> so whatever the Scald King's wizards did may not work. Or it could explode. Great. Hold up the medallion and see if you can make it work. Uh, what should we expect it to do? Thanks to the Scald King's wizards, it should lead us to magic similar to what's contained right, in the yes, jewel. Yes, yes, yes. You just said Ice that. Ice reach magic. Just take it out and give it a try. <sighs> All right. Uh. Do I have it? Is it in my inventory? Yes. A relic recovered from a witch of the Ice Reach Coven and imbued with location magic by the Skull King's wizards. All right. Uh, follow the magic trail. What? No, oh, there we go. It actually worked. Follow that trail. I'll take the other one. Cool, cool. All right. Uh. Oh, charred corpse. Charred note. Find anything? I did. So, find anything that will help us locate the Ice Reach Coven? Uh, the medallion led me to these burned bodies. I found this charred note on one of them. I was led to a similar site. Damn witches! Whatever game the Ice Reach Coven is playing at, we need to put an end to it. Preferably with multiple swings of my axe. Let me see the note you found. Uh, the only words I could make out were a lucrative opportunity. <sighs> That's no help. Luckily, Yorin's scouts provided a few locations of interest with their last report. Let me mark them on your map. When you reach each location, use the medallion and see where the magic leads. I'll catch up with you shortly. All right, I'll see if I can learn anything at the locations. First ice storms, now fire. Keep your guard up. The coven won't hesitate to kill anyone who gets too close. Uh, alright, so where are we going? Mm. My map's kind of cluttered. There's one over there. the way shrine yeah. <laughs> Use the medallion. I'm gonna find some more crispy fried bodies. Arrow fiend, what the hell? No, oh, someone else has already taken care of them. <laughs> Makes my life easier, I guess. Uh, let's have a look. A mangled bloody note. Alright, 
right, so where's the next one? Over here? Yes. Um, I hope I can actually reach it from here. Kind of an awkward area of the map. Oh, yep, there we go. Mmm. Oh, bugger off. Should get my horse, really. Oh, Christ. The hell? Our business is no concern of yours. Oh. Well, that was alarming. Witch Pike Shard. Where's Lyris? Oh, she's been in the scrap. Nothing like a quick battle to get the heart pumping. Mm-hmm. But I'm surprised we haven't faced more opposition. Coven must be preoccupied. Wasn't expecting to fight vampires, though. Did you find anything interesting at the sites I marked on your map? Uh, yep, I found another note on a strange kind of blood fiend. A blood fiend? You don't usually run into them in this part of the world. Let me see the note. Huh. There's that word again. Lucrative. What's that about a simple ritual? Sounds like coven activity to me. Anything else to report? I found this piece of a ritual item. I don't like the look of that. It feels wrong. The Skald King's mages will want to examine it. In the meantime, we need to figure out what the coven is up to. How do rituals, vampires, and blood fiends figure into their plan? Any idea where we go next? Eh, just one. A note from a merchant named Gohearth Ironbelly, founded on these vampires. Ironbelly is apparently supplying something the Coven requires, but the note doesn't go into details. It says we can find him at a rift in Inn, the Withered Tree. Okie dokie, let's go. The Withered Tree, over this way. The note said Iron Belly does business at the Withered Tree Inn. This way. Yes, I know. Once we spot Iron Belly, we'll follow from a distance until he leads us to the coven. <sighs> She's not very fast runner, is she? Casual jog. This is the place. Let's head inside and finalize our plans. Iron Belly's note suggested he'd meet with the coven after he did some business in this inn. When he arrives, don't do anything to alarm him. We want the merchant completely at ease when he leaves to go rendezvous with the witches. Okay, uh, what do you want me to do once he gets here? Just mill about and try not to draw attention to yourself. Have you seen Honestly, my I'm outfit? Honestly, I'm comfortable with the direct approach, but we need to play this carefully. Then when he leaves, he can lead us directly to the coven. Uh, alright, I will stand back and stay out of the way. Don't look conspicuous. At all. Ah, 
good lizard. I'll take a pint of your finest ale. And what have we here? You're a strapping lass. Let old Iron Belly buy you a drink or two. What do you say? Not interested. Not interested? Go hot, Iron Belly never takes no for an answer. Go away, little man, before <laughs> I break you. I beg your pardon, but things will be different after that witch lives up to her promise. Mm-hmm. Cool. All right. This is the part where I need to be sneaky. I'm terrible at sneaking. It's never been my strong point in pretty much any game. Probably don't need to actually be sneaking as long as I uh, keep my distance. Where's he just gone into? The rat way. Oh, anyone who played Skyrim knows this place. Well, that doesn't sound good. Never fails. Follow a rat, you wind up in a sewer. Mm -hmm. The next prey is mine. Great. Why my sewers always smell so bad? You do know what they're oh, for, don't you? Find Iron Belly. I'm gonna cave in his head for dragging us down here. <laughs> my armor will never be mistaken for a bed of roses, but sewer stink lingers like Thane Yagi around the meat hall. <laughs> uh, how did you know where to find me? You followed Iron Belly. I followed you. Mm. Come on, let's find Makes that sense. slimy merchant and see what he's doing down here. Uh, do you think he's meeting the Ice Reach Coven down here? Thieves and murderers aren't the only scum that inhabit the Ratway. The local Jarl keeps sealing the entrances, but it never stays closed for long. It would make a perfect lair for the Coven. Watch your step and try not to blunder into any traps. I will do my best. Ooh. Gross. No, oh, damn it. Sneaky bastard. Oh, balls. He rigged the gate to lock behind him. Look, don't wait for me. Find Iron Belly. Yep, yep. On it. Oh, more of these things. Death Hound. Oh, great. Just keeps getting better. Whoops. 
Ah. All right, fine. That's weird. Where am I going? This way. I don't know if they're bugged or something, where they're just not taking damage for a, a few seconds. Ow. Were you followed, Iron Belly? Of course not, Sister Balra. My caution is legendary. And have the arrangements I requested been made? The flyers have been distributed. And your friend with the fangs? Busy, I'm afraid. You promised a vampire would turn me! Make good on our deal, or I'll report this to the Jarl! You will do nothing of the sort! Oh, he did. That was convenient. Greedy fool outlived his usefulness. Hmm. Uh, look for evidence near his body. All right. Have to see how we get up there. Yikes. Upper rat way. Mm. Lucrative opportunity in East March. Oh. Uh, a lucrative opportunity awaits hard workers with strong backs and good constitutions who wish to earn a generous amount of gold. Come to the Grinning Hawker, an inn in northwestern East March. Just follow the path up into the mountain west of Volyar's Meadery. All capable and interested parties welcome. Finally, this place is amazing. Wait, what happened? Well, he's dead. As you can see. I hope Iron Billy told you something before you killed him. It wasn't me. So what happened? Did you get too close? Did he attack you? I didn't kill him. He argued with a woman he called Sister Balra, and then she murdered him. Damn. That must have been one of the Ice Reach Coven witches. Any idea where she may have gone? Well, this flyer mentions an inn in East March. That's not much to go on, but it's all we have. I'll meet you at the cart outside of town. Okie dokie. Cool. Alright, well, this was delightful, but let's get out of here. Okay, where's this cart at? By all these people, presumably, yes. All right, the cart's ready. Now tell me what else you found out down in the Ratway. Well, I overheard Ironbelly tell the witch that the flyers were distributed, and I found one on his body. Let me see that. Huh. Another lucrative opportunity. Mm-hmm. But this time we know where they're leading people. To an isolated inn somewhere in East March. Did you hear anything else that I need to know? Iron Belly said something about a vampire. He wanted them to turn him. A vampire? Yeah. Working with the coven. That would explain the strange blood fiends in the rat way. We'll worry about that later. Right now we have to get to East March and find that witch. Oh, before we leave, take this. You earned it. Oh, thank you. The cart will take us to the Grinning Horker in East March. Hop aboard and we can get along. I don't want to give the Coven any more of a lead than they already have. 
Okie dokie, uh, what do you think we'll find at the Grinning Hawker? Answers, I hope. That's what you and the Scald King sent me to find, after all. The Witches of the Ice Reach Coven are definitely up to something. Luring unsuspecting folk with promises of wealth. We saw what happened at those ritual sites. So, you think the people who responded to the flyer we found are in danger? Tempted to a desolate area in East March, most likely to be subjected to more of those strange rituals. If that doesn't scream danger, I don't know what does. Yeah, yeah, you're right. Will you accompany me, my friend? I'd appreciate your help in this matter. Of course I will, Lyris. It would be my pleasure. If you're ready to travel to the Grinning Horker, climb aboard the cart. We'll be in East March before you know it. Uh, before we go, let's review what we already learned about the Coven's plans, just for those of you who aren't paying attention. Good idea, but so far the pieces don't tell a complete story. We found evidence of the Coven luring people with promises of gold so they could experiment on them. Ritual items, vampires, and strange blood fiends. What does it all mean? Uh, have you ever seen anything like the strange pike before? I've seen similar totems, but nothing exactly like that witch pike. It disturbed me just to look at it. It appears to be a key component to their ritual, though the Scald King's mages will determine that for certain. Does the coven normally work alongside vampires? The Ice Reach Coven consists of witches and warriors of the Reach loyal to their cause. I never saw a connection to vampires before. Maybe the bloodsuckers are hired help? Mm. Come on. Hopefully we'll learn more when we get to the Grinning Horker. Yep, yep. Uh, what do you think of the strange blood fiends? You saw what I saw. Those feral creatures were near some of the ritual sites. And each site appeared to be a slightly different version of the ritual. Like they're trying to perfect it. Hmm. Curious. Alright, let's go. Ah, uh, cool. So... We need to walk from here. Follow the path up the mountain. Uh, this path? Yes. Screw it. I'm gonna get on my horse. Keep up, Laris. Come on. <laughs> cool. All right. This would appear to be the place. Where's Laris? There she is. No, you did pretty well. Well done. Place looks empty. Let's talk. It's so not empty. <laughs> These are all other players, but nothing waiting to impede our progress. No guards. No witches. Nothing. Just a lonely inn on a desolate hillside. If Iron Belly's flyer led us astray, we're gonna head back and kill him again. <laughs> uh, were you presumably you weren't expecting the place to be deserted? I expected answers. Iron Belly sent people here for a reason. They have to be someplace. If we don't pick up the Coven's trail, I'm not sure we'll find them again in time to stop whatever the witches have planned. Let's take a look around. Alright, uh, what are we looking for? Anything that points to what the witches are up to. We need to determine the full extent of the threat. Let's explore the inn and look for any clues as to what happened to the people they lured here. With luck, that may lead us to the Coven. Alrighty, let's do some snooping. Oh, conveniently placed quest markers telling us where to look. Half-eaten dinner. I've never known a Nord to abandon a meal while there's still food on the plate. <laughs> uh, where's that? Upstairs? Use bedroll. Bedrolls. For those who came for the lucrative opportunity. Mm-hmm. I wonder where they are now. Probably dead. Uh, 
Oh. Suspicious blood trail. Leading into a cellar. That's always a good sign. Fresh blood. It leads to that hatch. Great. The trail leads into the basement. Yeah, that's exactly what I was thinking. All right, let's go. Empty. That's not right. There must be a secret passage. See if you can find it. Are we going to end up in Narnia? I wonder. Sodden rags. No, thank you. Moth-eaten shirt. Old horse blanket. Uh, this one. I knew there had to be a secret passage. Let's see where this goes. Yeah. Ooh. How far down does this tunnel lead? All right, as long as we don't have to collect any crimson nern root. Ooh, glowy. I won't go back. I won't. We're not going to hurt you. Talk to him. I'll take a look up ahead. Uh, you're right. You aren't one of the Reach Witches? You have to help me. Alright, uh, calm down and tell me who you are and what happened to you. We were in the Hawker, waiting for them to tell us how we were going to make a pile of gold when they ordered us to go to the basement. One of us refused. They cut him. There was so much blood. And how did you get away? When we saw the Reach Witches, a few of us tried to fight. I slipped away before anyone noticed. They're doing something terrible down here. Something monstrous. Please, you must help the others. And you need to destroy the pikes. They're evil. All right, uh, stay calm. Wait here a moment while I talk to Lyris. Where's she gone? Whoa. It's quite a place. Look at it, my friend. I thought it was just an old legend, but it's real. It's real. Let's pretend I don't know what you're talking about. Blackreach. The world below Skyrim. Every Nord child hears the stories. How another world stretches beneath the Nine Holds. Each story is slightly different. Some talk about dwarven cities, others about terrible monsters or fabulous treasure. And you think this is Blackreach? What else could it be? Whatever it is, it's a perfect hiding place for the Ice Reach Coven. We need to get down there and find the witches. We must put a stop to whatever evil the Coven is planning. Uh, Frolt mentioned other prisoners and said he saw witch pikes. The poor man is frightened out of his mind. I'll escort him back through the tunnel to the Grinning Horker. Meanwhile, get down there and see what you can find out. If you see any witch pikes, destroy them. I'll catch up with you shortly. Okie dokie, you got it. This guy's just strolling along with his torch. Chilling. That's pretty cool. Can I get through here? Aha! Oh, okay, I can just do that. <laughs> Thought I was gonna have to, like, fight it. Got some Dwemer automatons. Yeah. 
can't use this. Nope. Uh, this way. Okay, it's not a good sign. Ice Reach Coven Note. Matron, we continue to modify and improve the ritual as our patron has requested. Soon we will be ready to attempt a large version in a more populated area. These harrow storms will accomplish the task as directed, but we have noticed an interesting side effect. While the storm draws what we need from living creatures within its influence, it often kills or transforms those it touches. Many of those afflicted by the storm are reduced to a new type of blood fiend, something we've come to refer to as harrow fiends. I will send complete details of the latest version of the ritual in a separate package. Sister Balra. Aha. Uh -huh. That's a caged harrow fiends there. Hmm. Uh, all right. Oh, my food ran out. Oh, you're still alive. That's the mud crab. <laughs> Bugger off, you little shit. Right. I don't have it quick slotted. Oh, this guy's just killing everything for us. That's fine. There you go, I helped. Oh, Jesus. That's kind of too late there. Working with those not of the coven. It disgusts me. Help! Help! You must set us free! Yeah, just let him deal with that. It's fine. Work smarter, not harder, I always say. Uh, Alright, we should probably let these people out. All of you! Follow me. We'll sneak out once the coast is clear. Come on. Hold, friend. Scoot. You need to hear what I have to say. Oh, okay. Thank the eight you came along. We were next in line for the witch's ritual. Uh, please, I need to tell you what I saw. What did you see? I saw the witches put some poor sods into a circle, surrounded by evil-looking pikes. They chanted and called forth a strange black storm. It killed some, but turned most of the people into those harrow fiends. That's what Sister Balra called them. Sister Balra. Uh, do you know where she is? There's a dwarven ruin west of here. Sister Balra has been using that as her personal domain. If she's around, that's where you'll find her. Damn it. I should have known. That flyer was too good to be true. The flyer? Is that how you wound up down here? I needed work. A lucrative opportunity was too good to pass up. It seemed strange when they marched us into the basement. We tried to fight, but there were too many of them. Kralt got away, though, I think. I just hope he made it to safety. Kralt is safe. Uh, meet up with your companions, and I will deal with Sister Balra. Or that other guy probably will. <laughs> Uh, right, where am I going? This weird glowy ice stuff. It's kind of cool. <gasps> Look at this guy. Oops. Wrong key. So glowy. Anyway, 
getting distracted. For Skyrim! <laughs> Yeet! Alright, Lyris. I got back as quick as I could. Other than a few skirmishes, I didn't uncover anything important. What about you? Tell me you found something. That was impeccable timing. Um, I smashed a witch pike and freed some prisoners. Two things I wholeheartedly approve of. I carved a path through a number of witches and vampires myself. Sure as bones there are a lot of these bastards. Anything else to report? Well, I found notes describing some sort of ritual. This is it. This must be what the Skald King is worried about. A ritual that produces harrow storms. Magic that turns people into a new kind of blood fiend. A harrow fiend. I wish I knew whose head I had to remove to stop this. Sister Balra from the Ratway is in charge here. She might be in the nearby Dwarven ruins. Sister Balra? Mm -hmm. The same witch that killed the merchant back in Riften. I'd definitely like to get my hands on that one. Let's go. Right behind you. I said right behind you. I'm supposed to be following you. A Windhelm sentry? Down here? Hey! Are you alright? I thought he was dead. That lying, manipulative witch. She stabbed me. Who stabbed you? We kind of already know this, but... The Reach Witch, Sister Balra. We had a deal. But she got in me. Listen, forget about me. I made a terrible mistake. I told her how to sneak into the Palace of Kings. Now I think the Skald King is in danger. Uh, what kind of danger? Balra said she had something planned for High King Yorin. Said I was a loose end. Please, I think she means to kill the Skald King. You must save him. I never meant to endanger Skyrim. Idiot. Sells out the Skull King for a handful of gold. Well, yeah. Assassinating the Skull King would be a terrible blow to Skyrim and the Pact, but I assumed the Ice Reach Coven had a grander plan than that. Nevertheless, we have to save Yorin. You think the Sentry was telling the truth? A deathbed confession? That tells me the Sentry believed he put the Skull King in danger. I can't take a chance when it comes to Yorin's safety. Back to the wagon. We leave for Windhelm at once. The Palace of Kings. Hurry. We must warn Yorin. Yep, yep. On it. Doesn't look like anyone's on alert. Maybe we got here in time. No, yeah, maybe. How's Carl? The skull you on. Where is he? I can't divulge such information. Even the great Lyris Titanborn must know that. It's a matter of royal security. Royal security? Listen, you little fool. You talk to her. Uh, hello. Who does Titanborn think she is? Demanding to see the Skald King. Lyris and I uncovered a plot against Yorin the Skald King. We have to warn him. Whatever you and the half-giant think you found is irrelevant. The Skald King is safe inside the Palace of Kings. It's the most secure structure in all of Skyrim. Well, one of your sentries accepted a bribe and told the Ice Reach Coven how to gain access to the palace. Hmm. Well, it's true that Sentry Darfel never arrived for his shift today. And High King Yorin is touring the palace, but that's supposed to be a secret. The Ice Reach Coven, you say? Yes, and they may already be moving against the Skald King. We need to get into the palace. How highly irregular. But if this is true... King Yorin wanted to tour the lower levels. 
to check on the progress of the construction. He could be anywhere. Go inside and find him at once. I'll rally the guards and secure the palace. Now hurry! Into the palace. Let's move! Oh, we Jesus. Find the skull king. I keep hitting the wrong button because I used to have uh, engulfing flames on my front bar. And now it's on my back bar. So I keep bar swapping too soon. Why would the Coven and its allies need that? I have no idea. Oh, this does look familiar. It's kind of cool. Skyrim Reconnaissance Map. map details the distribution of troops throughout Skyrim. Look, they tore off the western holds. Hmm. Everyone's looking pretty dead. Ice Reach Death Dealer. Rothdar is uh, doing most of my work for me. Sentry armor. Dungeon key. All right. Yorin wasn't up here, so let's search down there. Yeah, I did that thing where uh, they didn't take damage for a few seconds. Strange. Looks like a bloody maze in here. Leave the Skull King alone, witch. Yorin is ours. He will make a fine addition to our patron's forces. Oh, are they going to turn him into a vampire? Enough of this! Now you will die! Oh, shit! Ow. Shifters. The 
they wanted to turn me into a monster. I've had enough of this dungeon. Let's talk in the throne room. Whew. How about that? That's my report, Skald King. Our friend can tell you more. Held captive in my own dungeon. If word gets out, I would be laughed off my rebuilt throne. And rightly so. On to business. I heard Lyris is the report. Now tell me, what did you uncover? Well, the Ice Reach Coven developed a ritual that turns people into a new kind of blood fiend. Yes, so Lyris mentioned. Harrow fiend, she called them. An ominous name. And that Sister Balra claimed she was turning me into a monster? What else did you learn about the Ice Reach Coven? They appear to be allied with vampires. Vampires? I have known both decent and terrible folk burdened by that curse. I take it the ones working with the coven fall into the latter category. Anything else? It's probably just as well I'm wearing a mask, really, because I'm a vampire. <laughs> um, the coven seems interested in the Harfinger hold. Hoffinger? Mm hmm. High King Svargrim rules that hold from the city of solitude. We don't see eye to eye, especially since neither of us will openly acknowledge the other's reign. Still, he should be warned. Talk to Lyris, I have much to think about. Yes, Skald King. Svargrim and the people of Western Skyrim can be real pains in the arse, but they're still Nords. Despite the differences between their holds and ours, we won't abandon them to the Coven's conspiracy. Alright, so let's go to Hafengar and deal with the Coven. Not so fast, friend. Western Skyrim doesn't exactly get along with Eastern Skyrim. Politics can be a tricky business, so I tend to leave that to the politicians. When King Yorin gives the word, then we go. Not before. Alright, uh, so what happens now? Now we celebrate our victory, and let Yorin's scouts do what they do best. Meanwhile, I'll work with the Skald King to figure out how to approach Svargrim with this news. In the meantime, take this. You earned it. I'll be in touch soon. Excellent, thanks. Uh, so, what have we got here? A memento. Chains of the Ice Witch. The Ice Reach Coven hoarded countless magical items on their cursed isle. These chains, for instance. What happens when you invoke their power? Let's see. Well, I'll have a look at that in just a sec. And Windhelm Scale Tunic Design Folio. Uh, okay, some outfit styles. Cool. Excellent. This isn't over. Not from what we learned of the Ice Reach Coven. For now, though, we rest and let the Scald King make plans. There'll be plenty of time to kill more Reach Witches another day. Um, I mean, why can't King Yorin just send us to Harfengar now? Isn't he the High King of Skyrim? There hasn't been a single ruler in over a hundred years. Jarl Svarter of Solitude refused to recognize Freydis as the legitimate heir. Ever since, the kingdom has been divided. Damn inconvenient at times like this. Yep. Uh, so who rules the two kingdoms? We kind of know this already. Yoran rules over eastern Skyrim from Windhelm, while Svargrim lords over the western holds from his palace in Solitude. If the Ice Reach Coven has targeted western Skyrim, it will take both nations to stop them. If we can ever agree on anything. And what do you plan to do while you're waiting for the Skald King? Train. Eat. Drink. Probably drink some more, but don't worry. I'll be ready when the Skald King gives the word. Then we'll move against the Ice Reach Coven. You have my word on that. Okay, so this is what the tunic and belt and shoulders look like that I just got. Doesn't quite go with the rest of my ensemble here, but uh, it's kind of cool, I guess. And the memento looks something like this. Kind of cool. 
All right. Well, I hope you enjoyed that. I certainly did. I am very, very hyped for Greymoor. It comes out for PC on the 18th of May and 2nd of June for console. In the meantime, I will be getting back to posting content more regularly. I'm not working at the moment due to the whole coronavirus situation. Uh, so I've got some time on my hands. So the plan is to continue my Outer Worlds Let's Play, which has been on kind of hiatus for a couple of months. Uh, and also get back to posting some ESO stuff. I will be streaming as well. You may have noticed that I've jazzed up all my channel art in preparation for that. So if you haven't already, drop me a follow on Twitch. I'm just left hand shake over on Twitch. Drop me a follow there and hopefully I will see you soon. Take care, be safe, be well, and I'll see you next time.